I agree. That was terrible, not good or impressive. Keswick did take his third. It was just super late. All right, I'm back. Let's go. Wait, what happened to Joe Kim? Did he just die after that call? Yeah. Oh no, he's here. Are you here? Yes, you are. Hello. So, we are currently up, or rather, we oh, are, are going into game, game two. Huh? Because um, are you in the game yet? Some tab. Yeah, I'm in the game. We are going into game two of Kazakh versus Shayna, aka Beamface. Shush, na, na. And people still asking about Cole versus Mammon. That was casted already, guys. It was casted by Elegant. What? Anyways. So, yeah. this is Fighting Spirit. And the bottom left is the blue Shna 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 Terran, aka Shna Shna Shna. Uh, in the top left is the Brown Zerg Kazik, who just uh, made the series 1-0 in his favor with some really awkward two blades play. Awkward but effective. Only effective because of missed micros. It's all right, Beamface got this. You got this, Beamface. No oh, commands in everywhere. It's over. This is true. Oh, see, I think that was Beamface's mistake last game. He didn't build enough command centers. Clearly. It all makes sense now. It all makes sense. Da -da -na 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 -na. Uh, so we have La Depot, La Overlord. Oh, wait, 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 wait. He did an extractor trick? Did he? What? Uh, guys, don't do an extractor trick unless you're nine pulling. <laughs> oh, tips <laughs> to the ISL players. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's not worth sale. it unless you're nine pulling, man. I'm uh, like absolutely sure. Over pull. Over. Sure. I am. I am absolutely sure it's not worth it unless you're nine pulling. What because happened? because one of those one of those crazy people did like. Did like the Excel spreadsheet with like how much you mine versus how much you lose, and I'm pretty sure it's not worth it unless you nine pool. Uh, so, and more yeah. importantly, of course I'm qualified to tell these guys what to do. God, you should have invited me into the round of eight. <laughs> I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm like favorite. I would have been favorite to win this whole thing, man. Oh my uh, God. I'm really eager to see. Uh... I'm really eager to see uh, the winner of Mammon and Cole versus the winner of Cute and Rams. That match. I'm, I'm, not, I'm really interested I don't to see know who people will finally realize that Mammon and Cole was already streamed. <laughs> Indeed. Jesus. I'm trying not to spoil it, but since I know who the winners are, I want to see that match. How do you know? I don't know who the winners are. Yeah. <laughs> what? We we first well first we casted Mans versus Cute, and second the spoilers up with the results. No, they're not. Um, <laughs> I agree. Uh, romantic from Team Liquid Net, hundred percent. Wait, what? He said thanks to the sponsors of the Star League. The commentators need to kiss their ass just a little bit more. So I think I'm going to hop on that in the same way I just did before. Make it real original. No, 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 no. you got to say it in all caps. It's better. Trust me. Caps, man. I don't live alone, so yelling in my house isn't really acceptable. But okay. <sighs> uh, at this point. Big thanks to the sponsors because, uh, you know, this kind of wouldn't exist without a simple layout by me and their generosity to see something good happen in the Brood War community. Uh, besides nothing. That's right, because nothing else is really going on. Um, first, let's start with the main sponsor, SYZ. Hold on for sale. SYZ Adrenaline, who is the main sponsor and. No, no, let me, really let me do started. it. SYZ Adrenaline! He's awesome! Yep. Yeah. Alright, continue. Yeah, I agree. He's awesome. 
Uh, he is uh, practically the owner of Team AOV. That's why this is the AOV Ike of Star League. Also to Elegant and Mega Shira, who are the leaders of AOV, who also help sponsor A1K1A4K1, who is a member of Team OD, who just lost their final member in the tournament today, Atclis.net, which is a domain hosting site, so if you need a server or, or storage, let them know. Ten Bagger, a part owner of BTCSportsBet.com, and KOS Templar, who represents the BGH.com. I, I love how you threw in a spoiler there, just in the shoutouts. You just kind of casually just snuck it in. It's pretty good, pretty gosu. What was it? I'm not going to point it out, because that will make it obvious. I'm going to hope no one caught that. I don't... I didn't hear anything. What happened? How about Michael O.D.? He said it's... Joke sports. him! Joke him! Uh. Oh my god. Uh, schnosh, 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 Mr. Miss Micro of last game has a terrible bunker. <laughs> just lost two SCVs to three lings because uh, his terrible bunker placement. No idea why it's there unless he's going to make a bunker wall straight across. Um, I think he just doesn't have much experience making buildings besides command centers, so he's not really sure where to put it. Touche. Uh, Kazik going three hatch muta, really low economy. I'm not. Was that two hatch into three hatch? What's going on there? That's super low economy. I wasn't paying attention. I'm eating my microwave dinner, man. What flavor? It's uh, shepherd's pie. You know why? You know your dinner's bad. When I can ask you what flavor and you answer honestly, it's not a flavor. <laughs> It's not a lollipop. <laughs> what the fuck, my? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Fucking trick questions, man. It's not fair. Uh, man. So. Dude, do Schnosh Schnosh Schnosh's horrible bunker placement. God, it's so bad. He has four reens just chilling behind his command center, which actually are this effective is right now. Another SUV. Yeah. Uh, he now putting up a scan. He has no idea that. Kazakh's mutas are just about to be pumping. Oh my god, no, no they're it not. It is safe for mutas if you ain't drones. Wow. What is the thinking behind that? I'm so uh, confused. I just said, he really likes drones. Touche. Uh, I'm gonna go to the bathroom on that note. That is so confusing. Well, he's getting plus one air car base without any mutas. Okay, he's finally making mutas. He's making two of them. Who will absolutely benefit from the plus one carapace. And he doesn't know about this attack. And oh, all the shit, units are stimmed. There's only one sunken. Late. Is there a medic? No there's... medics. Oh my god, there's no medics. This is mass firebat. Mass firebat push. Oh my god. Oh, he's going for the drones. He's roasting drones. One sunken goes down. The firebats are going for the drones. He's going for the drones. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> roasting so every single drone me. at the natural. So Beam face. Buddy, you just lost all your drones, buddy. <laughs> Beamface, how's your ego, bro? Oh my god. Why didn't you make mutas, Kaiser? It makes no sense. If you made mutas, you would have held that off perfectly. But instead, you made drones, which all died to firebats. <laughs> well, you got you got plus one armor. It's fine. It's it's fine. <laughs> Three mutas against. Is it? Oh, did he cancel it? Oh, he canceled his plus one armor. Against 12 turrets. Good job. It's... So he's not even... Have... That has a, yes, such a good advantage. You even made him turtle up retardedly because that bunker. And now you're trying to mute a micro. Fail. Why did you do that? You just ruined your lead. You could have won this 2 0 right there. If you just made me this. Well, he's got a den up without even yeah. having a full pack of mutas. Oh, are we talking about his weird tech still? Uh, right, he... so get oh my game. god, game, did you Don't miss that? Beamface yeah, ran in with like 10 fire bats and roasted all the drones of the natural. No medics. Nice. No medics. Nice. He had only one fucking. <laughs> So, uh, I would like to point out that Schnashnashna could have 
easily lost this series if Kazik wasn't so, how do I put it nicely, retarded. Oh! Suck yeah, and bust! Like I said, man, you should be a diplomat. Oh my god, so many drones going down! It looks yeah, like the Medic Marine the will go down, but the drones, man, those four drones. But well, yeah, if Kaz makes so, so many of them, because he, he's offensive with them. He uses them at I have offensive drones, you have offensive GGs. Let's see who wins. Uh, putting up two fact is uh, shna shna shna, but um, I still haven't got that point out. Kazik had such a huge advantage. Uh, shna 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 didn't even have a scan up, had no idea what was going on. And at the same time, that Kazik could have mutas. Oh no, these mutas are trapped! The oh mutas! The mutas! The mutas are all going down! Oh my god! He tried more. to counter his uh, economic damage, but clearly failing. Kazik oh, now so has no economy, he has no mutalisks, he's no third base. He's in some serious trouble right now. Is he getting lurker upgrade? He's not oh, even getting lurker upgrade so from his. Has lurkers Wait, spawning as that role. Oh, he doesn't no, he lurker. lurker upgrade. He just put up two evolution chambers, though. Yeah, how does he afford Another this? Crazy tactic. He's gonna go for a uh, Hydro Lurk with a plus, uh, plus one range, plus one armor. If he was going to do that, I think he'd be upgrading Hydra speed. But he's not. Uh, he's going out to suicide his lurkers. Yep. Uh oh, uh oh, is he going to get the second one? It's borrowing! Oh. But why did he, he borrow? Why like didn't he just run? I, I think he should have just run. Clearly right? not. Is he going to bust him right now? Oh my god. These lurkers are about to yeah. pop, though. Yeah. I don't think he can break it now. Nope. And you only have one medic up there. We got two Tomatoes. back tanks yeah. coming out though. Yeah, he is upgrading Hydro Lurk upgrades. But he doesn't have any speed going inside Hydro 10. Um, two fact, perfect counter to it. I don't foresee this game taking that much longer. Kazik finally gonna put up his third 11 minutes in the game. So it turns out that Beamface actually makes more tanks in TVZ than TVP. That's pretty cool. Meet my mic time. Alright. Uh, now, of course, the plus one attack is what Game was talking about when he said the Hydro Lurker upgrade, um, because otherwise normally you would get melee attack, uh, since you're going for uh, Hive tech, and you're not going to make uh, too many Hydras. And by too many, I mean you're going to make none, usually. Uh, m and group's chilling at the 12 o'clock, going to get spotted by a Ling. The third base is going down at the top right, so that's pretty nice. Probably wants a couple of lurkers here to defend it. It's just scanned it. Oh, it's scanned, but the lurker's there already. There's only one, though. Uh, one lurker will not hold a ramp at all. The marines can just run right past it. Looks like Beanface is stimming and going for it immediately. Um, also, bunk wow, defending his natural super tightly, although all those bunkers are empty. But that's fine. Uh, one is CV at the bottom right. I don't know if that's scouting for hidden expos. No, he is building an expen- Wait, he's building a barracks in the bottom right. Fantastic. I don't... Uh, He's gonna make ghosts from there. Oh, <laughs> uh, we have a stim! Oh! The mer the lings are blocking! <laughs> the lings! Oh my god, those lings. Even forcing a second scan right there. Unnecessarily. Oh! But the M&F, they got a micro. Can they do it? The hatchery is finished. He might just stim and go for the hatchery. He's gonna get one lurker. No! Oh, better live. 13 HP, he is going for the hatchery! Gonna go for that lurker, gonna do some micro- Oh, gets one lurker! Oh no, but two marines get skewered, I don't think it's gonna happen. He might be able to snipe that one lurker, but that will be about it. 